Hi there, welcome back to the 31st video Learn Excel with Karpakam. In this video, I am going to show you how to do a VLOOKUP from another workbook. Let's get started. With regard to the last video, few of the people have written back to me asking when to use the exact match and when to use the approximate match and I'm going to show that to you today. You can see with the existing workbook, I have got two sheets, one called as a VLOOKUP exact match and VLOOKUP approximate match. What we are going to do here is, I'm going to pull out a data from another workbook. You can see this is session 31 and I have got another book called as a session 31A. What exactly I have done here is, I have arranged my window. I'm going to show that to you now. As of now, it's 31A wherein you can see I have got the range table of VLOOKUP for an exact match and separately for an approximate match. Let me go back to the first window and in order to do a VLOOKUP from another workbook, I'm going to show you a simple yet effective method. I'm going to arrange the window side by side for an easy comparison. Let me go to the window and in the window pan click arrange all. When you click arrange all, it's going to ask you what is that you want to do, choose vertical click OK. Now that you can see both the windows are side by side, you can see session 31 and this is the first active book. When I click it in a particular file cell of session 31, this becomes active and this becomes inactive. Now let me go and fetch the data for a active workbook first. When we look at the exact match, this is the very first table that I'm going to work on. What exactly is the exact match? When you have a data wherein you want only that particular data to be retrieved, then we work with the exact match. In case of an approximate match, always approximate match works within a particular range. Say for example, in this case scenario, we have got the sales here and the sales range. Anything between 0 to 4,999 should get us 1 percentage commission. Here we have not specified the range as 0 to 4,999 and in the second case 5,000 to 9999 we did not specify you will not be able to specify that in a vlookup and vlookup will not be able to extract only because of this simple reason we have just said 0 5000 10000 and we went on and whenever we use a range that is when we use a approximate match let's go back and do a exact match and approximate match i'm going back to my original sheet this is where i want to do a vlookup let's do the vlookup equal to vl tab where is the lookup value Richard Janssen is the lookup value because we want to know from which region Richard Janssen comes from. Click on D7, comma. Where is the table array? Table array comes from this particular sheet. When you look at this, you can see it's going to tell me session 31A. This is the file name, session 31A. Exact match is the sheet name and C6 till D17 is the range. And this has completely locked the table so that the table value doesn't change when it keeps looking for it. And now that we have done this, click on here, come on. What is the column index number? You can see sales representative is the first column and second is the region. So we want the region two, comma. Is it that we are looking for a true match or is it that we are looking for a false match? We are exactly looking for a exact match. So supply zero, zero for a false match and one for a true match. Close the bracket, hit enter. You can see it has got us the region. Richard Johnson belongs to South. And I double click at it, you can see Adam Jr. belongs to East. And then Vijay Kumar belongs to East. Then again, Kashyap belongs to North and so on. You will be able to see. In order to compare it easily, I have got this sheet side by side. Let us go and do it for approximate match. Let's move on. And let me go back to the approximate match table here. Here you can see the range 0 to 4,999 should return as 1%. 5,000 till 9,999 should return as 2%. 75,000 till 89,999 should return as 14%. And 90,000 greater than 90,000 will return as 18%. I want to calculate the commission rate here. Let me come back. Equal to VL. Open the tab. What is the lookup value? Lookup value is the sales because we have got the sales range here. Go and click on the lookup value. Comma. Where is the table array? Table arrays in sheet session 31A. When I go and click on this, you can see automatically it shows session 31A, which is the sheet name here. Approximate match is the sheet name here. And C6 till D14 is the range it has taken. Come, what is the column index number? Commission percentage is in the column number 2. Come on. Is it that we are looking for an approximate match or exact match? In this case, approximate match. 
supply 1 for a true match and 0 for a false match. In this case, it's true. 1, close the bracket, hit enter. You can see 73,403 lies in the category of 50,000 to 74,999. So it has got a 10 percentage. Let me go back and click at the pointer. Automatically, it creates the commission for all the cell. This is one of the best way wherein you can do approximate match and a exact match. I hope you have enjoyed the video. Thanks for joining. Stay tuned for more such videos. See you soon.